What's going on everybody? Mitch here and welcome back to Civilization 6 and welcome back to our Nubian playthrough on DD difficulty and the true location start for the Nubians. Man, it feels good to be back doing some recordings for YouTube. I have missed it. I've been dealing with some personal stuff. Also the flu, that's why I may sound congested and runny and cough a lot and why I'm wearing a beanie and why I might look flushed. A whole bunch of other excuses, but we're back playing Civilization. Let's get ahead and get going. We are still definitely afraid of the Congo because this, because they're in my land. I don't know what they're doing. What are you doing, Congo? Why are you, why are you in my land? Do we have open border still? I guess we do. I still don't like you in my land. We, uh, we boosted construction with a watermill, so that's good. Uh, we have a free slot for our capital. We could go entertainment, but I think I want to go encampment. Ooh. So I'm not worried about the Egyptians. I think this is their only... I'm pretty sure this is their only city right now. From what I can tell. So it's pretty much only the Congo. So I could put one here. And that would protect Naphtha and Moreau. But I'm kind of more worried about Damascus than I am Nap Naphtha. Actually, I'm mostly worried about Zanzibar, my favorite town to pronounce. But I think Damascus is my biggest worry because it's a big chunk of land we have there, too. <coughs> Excuse me. See, like I said, I may be coughing a lot, uh, but that means that we have to buy this, and that's a decent chunk of change. We're gonna go do it. Just pull the bandaid off and do it. You know, get done with. So we got the encampment building. We got a library building in six turns, seven turns for the encampment, three turns for a new campus, twenty-one over here for another campus, and we got plenty of stuff going on for many turns to come. About to finish horseback riding. I think we get a nice Winston Churchill quote. If I remember right, that's how many times I've played this game. Started memorizing the quotes. A man on a horse is spiritually as well as physically bigger than a man on foot. See? I go and say I'm going to get a Winston Churchill quote, and look, I get a John Steinbeck quote. I was thinking of a uh, Winston Churchill quote about you know, any day of spent the saddles, not a day wasted or something like that. But that works too. That's why I like Civilization, because you get all these very interesting quotes from influential people. So there we go. <coughs> Last time I'll ever predict what you're going to do, Civilization. Making me look a fool. So Congo's got a knight. They also have their special troops over here. I wonder what their strength is versus swordsmen. Are they spear? They like spear. I'm not sure. Zanzibar has needs housing, as well as Aleppo, and Napta wants food. They're always asking for so much, and they get so much food around you. What are you talking about? There's fish. Greedy people. Terracotta army is finished. Wealth <coughs> consists not in having great possessions, but in having few wants. Okay. Purchaseship is what I'm looking forward to next. Kinda wish I held off on my camp for industrial, but the cabinet's kind of a need as well. Granary, granary would be nice. We do need housing. Library would be nice too, though. Let's go ahead and get granary so we can take care of the housing issue. And it's better we don't. We slow down progress by boosting production. 
slow down our, uh, our people's growth. We don't need them growing while they have no housing. Okay, there's a lot of troops on the border here, guys. Let me at least finish my encampment before you attack me. Defense is superior to opulence. Sure. So since they look like they're about to attack me, I'm definitely going to use this card. I think... I don't have the ability to build any ships right now, or don't have the want to build any ships right now. I want ships in the near future. I think this is the one that needs to go. Ancient and classic air melee ranged weapons. Melee and ranged weapons. I feel like I'm gonna need the more modern one of these soon though. But this this setup will work for now. It'll be a couple turns when we get to change it again, so. That'll give us a little defensive boost. Don't care about mysticism. Don't really care about drama or poetry. Envoy is pretty nice. Seven turns. Campus adjacency bonus is nice. That's nice. Do that, do that. Do that. We just have to go through here. It's a lot of turns. Yeah, we'll get out of the way. At least get that first one out of the way, and then we'll see if we still want to stay on that path. Two turns to the library. What a great lighthouse has been built. That seems kind of late, the great light lighthouse being built. I need a scout too. I need to scout out in this direction. Australia should be down here somewhere, right? Because this is Madagascar. It's the horn. This should be South Africa right down here. Yeah, should be Australia. Somewhere out there. Somewhere on the water. There's some Aussies. Doing something. Our empire's kind of scraggly, but we're, we're holding together. Damascus is ready for something. How are they doing? Happy on amenities. Housing is okay, but they are slowing. We could do aqueduct. We'll lose the rainforest. We can go granary first, which would probably be the smarter choice. Which we'll do that. A lot of going on in the Congo. I wonder how far this way they expand. Or not too far if it's, you know, this is like southern Africa. Masculine housing, which we're working on. One turn, we get our encampment. We'll move this archer down here. We'll move this warrior here. We actually need to move a warrior. Let's go ahead and move one over here. Hit the medieval era. Nice. Military training is advanced. There is no easy way to train an apprentice. My two tools are example and nagging. Thank you, Lemony Snigget. We get plus one production to the mine improvement, which is nice. They need food. They need housing. That's that boost we just got, and that's the 
uh, Aztec wonder being finished. So move that guy there. Let's start moving him in the air. Stay there. You there. think I mean it says this is a good choice but I think we want to go to machinery that'll probably be good at some point too the plus one movement gonna need that sooner or later Let's get a barracks because that's going to help our ranged units and <clears throat> we don't have much cavalry or any plans for cavalry really either two turns so we can get our builder going <coughs> <coughs> excuse me Congo, man. I just don't know what to think. <clears throat> friendly. They're friendly with a lot of people. <clears throat> friendly with the Congo. I'm pretty sure Congo attacked them? <laughs> uh, okay. <clears throat> so they don't respect our military. Why are we in the military ranking? Military score one eight six. Where is she? She's a lower military rank than we are. What the hell? Why is her military so weak, by the way? Surprising. Someone turned Hinduism over here. Saw a flash of Hinduism off in the corner. Awe, Viator. Augusta e Roma Imperator Caesar Traianus Sum. Qui ses. Qua e terra patria vocas. Hopefully your lands I can claim as my own one day. <sighs> Don't worry about my culture. The poets have been mysteriously silent on the subject of cheese. Okay. I'm not sure what to think about that quote. We'll uh, continue on. This is a tough one. Industrial won't really help me much. I think the best thing I do is go harbor. <clears throat> Let's do a harbor. She might have to hold off on this one. I think I'm gonna want this lumber mill before whatever I do. Greenery. This town has no production. Oh, I can't stand this town. We'll put like. I don't know. I don't know what we'll put in this town. A bean farm, something. This town's terrible. Or it's expanding next. Is it expanding? Probably not. They're gonna offer me 17 gold, eight. What just happened? Nine gold per turn plus sixteen gold. 
total? That's pretty good. Because what did she offer before? 8 gold and 17 gold? I like this better. I like the more gold for 30 turns. Works out more in my favor. Yeah, okay. So I should have gone over here first. Because we're going to want this lumber mill. Okay, so that's done. Mm, let's go library. <clears throat> Is this city safe or starving? Hey, okay, housing. They don't have they don't have a positive growth amount of food, but they don't have negative. They're not really starving. They're just being whiny babies. Congo's scaring the crap out of me, man. I haven't built a military unit in a hot second. Remember that people break down too, not just machinery. So now, now our special unit is obsolete. One, two, three, four. Let's get that out of the way. I'm not too concerned about the night. Hmm. How are we doing the housing? Plenty of housing. Housing for days. We need a population of seven or greater. We got a minute <laughs> to wait for that. Let's build a builder or scout. No scouts? Oh, scout. Okay. Because I want to know what's down here. Then we can do a builder. Actually, kind of curious what's up here, too. Doesn't look like anyone wants this land over here. Jesus, what the hell happened? Increases healing by three is a whole okay. Got our bonus. I think this is probably the best one available. Cool. I mean, all the religions have been founded, but, you know, whatevs. I don't even have a theater square district. Uh, let's build a plant there. Ugh. Shush. I'm gonna build like a lumber mill over here. Damn elephants make a lot of noise. John Curtin. I speak for the people of Australia as their Prime Minister. We seek sympathetic allies in the fight against the hawks of war. Anytime I hear him talk, I just want to say, Good day, Governor. Where were you at? Where did I meet you? Where did I see you? Okay, cool. But you, will you take my delegation? Okay. <clears throat> will you take my friendship? Okay, there we go. We are friends. And what about you, Greece? What you doing? What you up to? Okay, you want to be friends too? Okay, we're just, just a friendly bunch. Everybody's friends with us now. 
Alright, so our capital wants some minis. You met Australians up there. Doing their religion thing. As they do. We have a scout somewhere. There he is. We're gonna send him out yonder. We can send him this way, but I don't really want to. I'm more curious what's over here. Actually, you know what? Let's go this way. Because they're protected by England. England is an island somewhere way over here. I'm not worried about England. Not at this moment. Let's do this stupid granary before these people starve to death, even though they're not starving. We need more trade routes. Sorry, Saladin. You shouldn't have sucked early game. The four building blocks of the universe are fire, water, gravel, and vinyl. I've lived through some terrible things in my life. Some of which actually happened. <laughs> Production, I'll see. That's really hard to give up. What was the one we just got? 100% campus district adjacency bonus I don't know how much stuff I have adjacent that's worth it right now Let's see on to the next thing I think we're gonna go mathematics <clears throat> to get that out of the way and then we can start going on to this route to gunpowder the Great Crusade there. That's a pretty good one. We might need that one. Because we need a Minis. Alliance is pretty good too. But the AI don't like to make alliances. What? Won't it let me go? Oh, because there's an enemy unit there. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. I would like to take this town. Mm. Whatever this wonder is, it's completed. Mm. We met Carthage. What kind of city are you? You are a production city. I like you. <clears throat> I would like to be your <clears throat> suzerain. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Trigger Eureka for stirrups. I don't think we're going to do that, though, because I'm pretty sure that requires <clears throat> something with horses. And we don't have any damn horses. Which I am positive of. Got mines there. This guy's a range unit, right? So it should get speed bonus, right? Oh. So England is right there. Gorgoemi, Havasileia, Stasparthas, and Hagemon ton Helenon. Ha! Is it she? Tinas Nikas Hoyos, the Siangelein. I'm curious what, uh. What kind of. Spars right there as well. They don't look very strong. What is uh, England's military ranking? 513? We're 196 and we haven't really been building towards the military in a while. So we could take out these guys. 
they are influenced by seven. But Victoria is a suzerain, so we declare war on them. Is that declaring war on Victoria? She only has warriors. Hmm. Victoria, who are you at war with? Anybody? No? You like Rome. You have an alliance with somebody I've never met. This is not good. Gorgo doesn't like you. Neither do I. Kind of want to take out Gorgo too. But I want this city state. That is going to be our goal next time for sure. Let's, uh. So, met them. What else do we meet? Sparta. The Greeks. <clears throat> Apparently, since it's Rainforce, we can't take it out. Is Rainforce a different skill? Did I miss that somewhere? Clearing Rainforce. So that's something I want to avoid doing. <clears throat> There's a lot of damn rainforest down here. We'll build lumber camps out here. <clears throat> Six damn corn over here. Six damn food. Holy hell. <clears throat> that's a lot of food. Okay, I found my new targets. <clears throat> I don't know what the Congo's doing, but... Damn it, I know what I want. Congo, we look like we're friendly? Just by... Uh, pretty friendly. Not ready to be friends yet. Gotcha. Cool. No somos Felipe, rey de España y Portugal. Empero, por encima de todo, somos fieles devotos de la única y verdadera religión. Ay, right, Look at all the sh... There's units! Holy hell! <clears throat> this thing has a lot of defense already, Jesus. So we met Madrid, they're up here. So they're in Spain. It's Gibraltar. Gibraltar. Up there. What the hell are the Greeks doing down here? I don't know. Okay, whatever. <clears throat> Whatever's. We can connect our empire this way. <clears throat> It'd be really easy to roll over Egypt, too, to be honest. Let me see you got left, chick. I don't want to declare friendship with you, because, uh... Oh, you have more seas than I thought. Oh, no, that's mine. Never mind. It's embarrassing. Man, we could roll her over. They have this encampment, which is would be tough. But if we stayed to the north with our units, just camp there. Catapult there. Catapult there. Catapult there. Boom, boom, boom. Swords been up front. At least go three catapult three swordsman we could uh we could easily take that out too oh we have so many new targets kind of we should start building up our military and then kind of seeing from there <clears throat> mass production boosted nice kind of go from there and seeing what looks like a good target that's gonna be the next for that Spain we met 
Okay, so yeah, we have uh, our new targets. There's a lot of weakness around us. Congo is the only thing that really scares me. Their military strength is 588. We're at 196. I feel like we can get pretty up there, though, in that range. And my voice is starting to go. So it's a great time to hit this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you're glad to be back as much as I am glad to be back in Civilization 6. And there's going to be more videos coming out soon. We're going to be back into a pretty regular schedule of posting videos. Of course, as always, I am streaming every night on twitch.tv slash bearded mitch. You can join me there around 9.30 p.m. U.S. Central Time. Uh, but until next time, guys, have a great one and later.